Yo, what is up guys? Welcome back to another video. Now today, well actually before we even get started, I just want to give a huge shout out to everybody who's been subscribing to the channel. The last video I posted went super, super crazy. You guys loved it. A lot of new subscribers. I just want to say thank you. But in today's video, we're going over Immovable Enforcer. This badge on Hall of Fame has turned my Carmelo Anthony build into like a defensive stopper. Now check it out, y'all. These are my attributes, all right? If you guys didn't see it, I have 31 interior defense and i have 75 perimeter i'm telling you this 96 strength right here that you see on my bill allows me to play crazy hall of fame defense like hall of fame clamp level defense it turns me into a defensive stopper on a build with no defense now look look at the badges all right you go over to b tier it's right here a movable enforcer enforcer it requires 95 strength to activate on hall of fame and this badge right here the second I unlock this badge, I have been getting so many defensive stops. It's kind of crazy. I mean, I'm stopping seven footers, seven foot one player, six eleven doesn't matter. I'm six eight with minimum wingspan. This is minimum wingspan, by the way. And what you're going to see in today's video is going to blow your mind. This is the power of a movable enforcer in NBA 2K24. All right, here we go. First play of the game. We are in the theater. I'm looking for my fade, getting to my spot. Easy, easy bucket. Now, uh, defensive possession. Here's what I want to show you. This a movable enforcer. Look at that. I didn't even jump, y'all. I don't. I don't even jump on those. I didn't jump at all. I just held my hands up and ran to him, and it instantly put me in that animation. So here we go again on defense. I get a good jump at it. My, mind you, 25 block gave me a 47% contest on that. Super, super good. So it just shows you that you really don't need block. You just need to have good positioning. Again, a movable enforcer. Hands up defense, baby. Hands up. No need to jump unless you know you're out of position. If you can get that body contact, hold those hands up. Here we go. Open three. Knock it down, baby. He was way too deep in the paint. I don't know why he's that deep in the paint, but is what it is. Point guard's looking for a, a play to make. He hands me the ball. I'm looking for my spot. Hand down. Man down. It's too easy, man. You got to jump at that fade that drill pull up you have to jump and i'm using drill pull up pro for anyone asking here we go again i just get some body contact the center just drops the ball hands it all to the guard guard gets an easy dunk man i'm telling you this immovable enforcer is playing great defense i don't know if it's just strength or just the badge or clamps tied in with strength i don't know what it is but everything is just adding up to just beautiful defense here here we go. Mind you, he's seven foot one, guys. This 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 guy right here, he's seven foot one. I don't know if that's strength. I really don't know if that's strength or just clamps on bronze just doing his thing. But hey, man, it's working for me. I find the open man. He well, he wasn't too open. Maybe I should have hit uh top of the key, but I'm in the corner. He jumps. Look at the help rotation by them, though. Great rotation. He should have hit the corner right there. Or maybe I should have hit the corner. I should have saw that rotation ahead of time. I go for a fade, but I oh, miss it slightly early, man. I knew I let that go a little bit too early. Wasn't locked in right there. But that was 100% greenable. It was a wide open shot. When you got these bigs on you, they don't have good perimeter defense, so their contest isn't as good. As you can see, I'm forcing him to pick the ball up with a movable enforcer, man. Hall of Fame, it goes crazy. Y'all got to invest in strength. We get the rebound, pick it out, and that just leads to pretty much instant offense like this we blow by him and get an easy dunk those seven ones they can't keep up man i'm pretty fast with the ball in my hand i'm not i'm not really that sluggish i have an 85 ball handle 75 speed with ball but right there he tries to go for the passing lane as long as you keep those hands up and they throw it directly at you even with a 25 steal like i have on this build you can still get the steal so here i am i'm looking for my shot once again can't really find it dot the corner wasn't really open he hits me back hit him with the triple uh triple strike the juke move stun him a little bit do a little snatch back, run to the rim, find an open man for the win. Knocked it down. And that's game number one, folks. So here we are with game number two. This is another seven footer, y'all. He's another seven footer. Look at this. Immovable in enforcer in the post. In the post. That's not post move lockdown. I don't have any interior. That's a movable enforcer, baby. Let's go. So we get the ball back. Triple strike. Find my spot. Knock it down. Too easy. Again, here we are on defense. This is 75 perimeter defense, by the way. Challenger on bronze gets a great contest. We get the ball. I'm fading. Another easy bucket. Now, I know that these guys are talking in game chat, and some of their mics are pretty bad, so I apologize about that. But look at the fade, man, from mid-range. Open shot. 
oh man blinders activate and everything it, it's just a great look an easy super easy look especially when you got these bigs on you man oh got them off the decks wide open shot 28 percent contested green i'm telling you these bigs cannot contest your jump shot they have to jump at it that's the only way they're stopping your jump your jump shot if they hold hands up shoot it in their face because their perimeter is already super low so here we go i'm looking for an open shooter find my guard he stops and pops puts us up 18 to 12. now in the next clip right here their point guard is dribbling around and i'm going to play some help right here hands up defense a movable enforcer activates gives me a 52 percent contest all i did was run to him with my hands up that's all i did no jumping no jumping at all my guard finds some open opportunity off the off the brick wall screen and phase it for the game now this is the final game i have here y'all so i know i'm going a little bit fast but i'm trying to talk and, and explain all the stuff i'm doing here find an open spot i mean you, you've guys seen that mini magician hall of fame you know how it goes i grabbed the rebound over this tall tall guy i think he's 6 11 or 6 10 i think he's 6 11 the guy in the lakers jersey but he flops i stop and pop would take over <laughs> that's easy that's that's what i don't why are you flopping that's way too easy man here we are back on defense i'm boxing out my guy rebounding over this 6 11 throwing the dot down the court easy two points but man guys if you don't have immovable enforcer i mean just look at this right here guys just look at this he get, he gets me with the postman beats me i hold my hands up and it and it warps me into the play again hold hands up i'm jumping right there because i thought i was out of position i'm holding my hands up here here we go holding hands up hands up hands up immovable enforcer i tried to get the rebound but for some reason it was making me walk backwards but look at this defensive possession y'all we're playing great defense immovable enforcer is going crazy right now on this defensive possession i think they they should have been able to score pretty easy but we're getting some good stuff he gets a good jump right there we get the rebound we're out in the break out in transition find the open man easy two points listen guys when you're coming into the theater you got to play team ball because everyone everyone is selfish in here everybody but again hands up defense he goes straight into me thinking he could just slash his way into the basket hold the hands up get some body contact easy stop but my point guard misses the wide open three <laughs> here we go man i don't know what they're doing playing patty k with the ball i'm wide open i get the rock up 18 11 with a wide open shot it's getting it's getting real simple now now that i'm in my bag a little bit it's getting a little simple and i haven't even really found out everything i could do i hit him over the spin pump fake got him jumping to the basket oh my god a perfect way to end the game but guys i'm still learning on how to play mellow man i have a lot more to add to my bag gotta work on that post game gotta work on my space creator shots but that's all i got for you guys today peace out